Okay guys, in this problem, a dump truck has an upfront cost of $100,000 and an expected salvage value of $15,000. It is expected to last seven years before the truck falls apart. What is the closest to the assumed value of the truck at the end of its fifth year of service based on the straight line method of depreciation? So the first thing we're going to do here is go to our PDF reference manual and keyword search for depreciation. That will take us to page 38 or 37 of our reference manual. And if you start on 37, you can just scroll down to 38 and get the equation for the straight line method of depreciation which is provided. So it's going to be dj equals c minus s sub n over n, where dj is going to be the depreciation value in year J. C is going to be our cost. S sub N is our salvage value in year N. and n equals the expected life of the asset. So we can start just plugging into the equation and filling it out. So dj is what we're solving for. c is going to be $100,000. S sub n is going to be $15,000, and n is the total lifespan of the truck. So solving for this, we get $12,142, which is really dj, but I prefer to think of it in this problem as the rate of depreciation per year. So we can do one final step now to get our answer and find the value after five years of depreciation of this asset. So we've got our initial value of the truck and we're going to subtract from that five years of linear depreciation. We can think of this to match our units up as five years times 12,142 so that the units cancel and we're left with a dollar to dollar comparison. At the end result here would be $39,290, which we can see is very close to our answer of C. If the problem had wanted to try to ask the question in a slightly different way, they could have asked, what is the amount that the truck depreciated by at the end of its fifth year of service? at which case we would just need to solve for one more basic step. So we now know the depreciated value at the end of five years. So we simply could have subtracted the original value of the truck or the depreciated value of the truck from the original value of the truck and gotten the amount that the truck depreciated by at the end of five years. In this case, the answer would have been about $60,000.